Welcome back to Factopia. Today's topic is mysteries of volcanoes. Ever wonder what's behind the fiery rage of a volcano? Today, we'll be taking a deep dive into the mysteries of volcanoes. The magma in volcanoes is less dense than the surrounding rocks. So under immense pressure, it bubbles up towards the Earth's crust. When this pressure is too great, we witness a volcanic eruption. An eruption can be a gentle lava flow or a violent explosion depending on the magma's composition. There are different types of volcanoes, each with its unique characteristics. Cinder cones are the simplest type, formed by explosive eruptions. Composite volcanoes or stratovolcanoes are built by multiple eruptions, while shield volcanoes are created by non-explosive eruptions. Volcanoes are a spectacular phenomenon, a testament to the raw power and energy housed within the Earth's crust. The molten magma, ash, and gases they spew create an awe-inspiring spectacle. The lava that flows from volcanoes also varies. There's mafic lava, which is low in silica and flows smoothly, and felsic lava, which is high in silica and tends to explode. The type of lava determines the volcano's shape and the nature of its eruptions. Our planet is dotted with about 1,500 active volcanoes. They are primarily found along tectonic plate boundaries, and most notably in the Pacific Rim region, a hotbed of volcanic and seismic activity known as the Ring of Fire. Volcanic eruptions can be devastating. They can trigger tsunamis, flash floods, earthquakes, mud flows, and rock falls. The ash can darken skies, causing a drop in temperatures, but they also have a positive side. Let's start with how a volcano forms. When the Earth's tectonic plates diverge or converge, magma from the Earth's mantle rises through the cracks. If this magma reaches the surface, a volcano is born. Volcanoes are nature's great architects. They've shaped our planet's topography, forming islands, mountains, and plateaus. The volcanic soil is fertile, making it excellent for agriculture. They also play a significant role in our climate. Volcanic gases like sulfur dioxide can reflect sunlight, thereby cooling the Earth. But they also release carbon dioxide, a greenhouse gas, contributing to global warming. Volcanoes are also a window into Earth's interior. By studying the gases and rocks they eject, scientists can understand the Earth's mantle's composition and its geological history. Despite our advances in technology, predicting volcanic eruptions is still a challenge. Scientists rely on signs such as increased seismic activity, gas emissions, and ground deformation. But these signs don't always lead to an eruption, keeping us on our toes. Volcanoes are a testament to the Earth's dynamic nature. They're a reminder of the power beneath our feet, shaping and reshaping our planet. As we continue to study them, we unlock more of their mysteries, getting a step closer to understanding our planet's past, present, and future. In conclusion, volcanoes are not just destructive forces. They are nature's way of revealing the inner workings of our planet. They teach us about the Earth's history, affect our climate, and enrich our soil. So, the next time you see a volcanic eruption, remember, there's much more than what meets the eye. Join us next time as we continue to explore the fascinating world beneath our feet. Until then, keep questioning, keep exploring, and as always, keep learning. Thank you so much for joining us today. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. If you have any questions, suggestions, or topics you'd like us to cover in future videos, please leave them in the comments section below. We love hearing from you and appreciate your feedback.